Hey guys, so as you can see from the title, this is gonna be my top 10 nude lipsticks. Now, the reason I decided to do this video is because oftentimes when I post on Facebook or um, Instagram, a lot of the feedback that I get is, what nude is good for me if I'm wearing a nude lipstick? What lipstick? What nude lipstick is that? I'm looking for a nude lipstick. I've never found a nude lipstick that works for me. So I wanted to come and give y'all, um, I want to say 10, 10 <laughs> nude lipsticks that work for me that are my favorite nudes. Now these range from your more pinky nudes, my lips look better, to um, the more gray tone nudes. Okay, and I've swatched them and everything, and I'm going to be inserting um, lip swatches here so you can see exactly how they look up against my complexion. Okay, so up first, I'm going to start with lip glosses since I'm not a big gloss person. So if you do see me wearing a gloss, it's usually going to be a nude gloss, and it's going to be one of these two. Okay, so first up is going to be this one, and as you can see, pinky end of the um, spectrum and it is Anastasia Beverly Hills sepia sepia however you want to say that gloss okay you've seen this on me in two to three videos I love this gloss if I'm wearing a new gloss more often than not it is this gloss it's perfect not tacky not like that sticky thing where you get like the lip stuff or whatever so love it and yeah pinkier end of the spectrum good shine up next is this one and it is Gerard Gerard, Gerard Cosmetics um, lip gloss in Cocoa Bean okay I hate this packaging I don't know why they feel as if you need a light but whatever um, and a mirror so tacky but <laughs> Love this gloss. Same thing as Anastasia. It's on the pinkier end, um, a bit deeper than the Anastasia one, but um, still comes off as a nude on me. Um, more on the my lips, but better since my lips are on the um, pinkier end of the spectrum. Um, so I, it's not like concealer lips or whatever. It is. It has a good tint, and it's not something that is too overwhelming. Okay. So let's get into the lipsticks. So first up is going to be Revlon's Mink. This is an oldie, but a goodie, y'all. This lipstick, as you can tell, this I go I go through this lipstick. I don't have to wear a lip liner with it. It is this first swatch here. It is legit my lips, but better. Okay. Don't have to wear a lip liner. I can throw it on. I use it almost like a tinted balm because it, it, it gives good color. It gives good color, but it's not an overwhelming color. So I can not have any makeup on and still um, wear it and not look out of place. Because if there's one thing I do not do, I will not wear something that is bold or something like that with absolutely nothing no other makeup on that is not me <laughs> so yeah Revlon mink drugstore get it on sale I buy it when I do whenever they do like buy one get one type deals or whatever this is what I'm buying all right <clears throat> then up next is going to be this one and it is max half and half okay so this is one that you're going to need a lip liner with if you're my complexion and i am nc50 in mac 500 w in lancome and 6w1 in estee lauder so if you're in that spectrum or in that range then half and half you need a lip liner um, it can come off a bit um, ghastly um but it is beautiful nonetheless it is their amplified um their amplified formula so moisturizing love it and i typically pair it with like a chestnut type mac chestnut type um lip liner okay next and i'm sorry guys but this these this is my favorite lips nude lip video so i don't think this is available anymore but it is max viva glam um gaga too so looking at it it's like black girl why are you gonna put this on your lips right i know i know it swatches like this 
right? So I understand. I understand the apprehension. I really do. But you pair this with, let's say, a chestnut um, lip liner and just put dab it you know just put it on the inside and when i tell you it is the freaking best um ombre it is everything everything so when i say pair lip liner pair lip liner lip liners can make a lot of things work and for viva glam too definitely definitely pair lip liner okay and then what is this one NYX matte lipstick. I hope they still sell these in butter. Okay. So this is what it is here. As you compare it to all the other ones that I have on my arm, this one is going to be the one that is running the most gray. And I might have to do this video because when I tell y'all I love a gray toned or even gray lipstick, I know that is not folks cup of tea and I, I totally get it, but a lipstick that pulls more gray, almost more kind of lilac-y kind of, I don't, I don't know how to, I'm, I suck at describing um, shades, but this shade here, this gray, pair it with a good lip liner you have an awesome 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 nude lip okay so don't be afraid of it don't be afraid of it all right so now we are this is an honorable mention because it's a Marc Jacobs lipstick and I'm not about that 30 40 dollar lipstick um, life but in a moment of weakness i bought it because it is such a pretty color so this is mark jacobs in mahogany okay and this is this one right here so it's probably the deepest of the nudes that i have and while it doesn't look per se as your classic nude on my lips it is running um hand in hand with um, mink. It's a lipstick that is super moisturizing. I love this formula, love this formula. And um, it it goes on and it it's my lips are better. And I sound like a broken record, but a lot of times when you're wearing a nude, if you go for your lip color but better, you, you can't go wrong, right? So getting into liquid lipsticks, the first one is going to be Lime Crimes, where is it? Lime Crimes um, Buffy, okay? And that is this one right here, okay? So pinky, like the half and half, um, it's almost half and half in a, in a liquid lipstick, but um, love it. I love Lime Crimes formula. I might have to do top liquid lipsticks formulas or my favorite liquid lipsticks but love lime crimes formula this color is awesome this is the color that i was wearing in the um sephora pro palette video that i did um in the first half of the video okay so so yeah love it love it love it and where is it again this one right here okay so now for the warmest one that i have and this is by Give Me Glow um, Cosmetics, I want to say. Give Me Glow. And they're an indie brand that I found on Instagram. I want to say they're located in Dallas. And this one is called Whiskey and Honey. Okay. Oh, and it says limited edition. I'm sorry, guys. Maybe she brought it back. But as you can see, this one is the warmest one out of all of them. It is so pretty on. So pretty on. Um, and of course... Hopefully I have this, the lip swatches. So pretty on and it's it's everything. So that is Give, Give Me Glow Whiskey and Honey, okay? So up next to for the ones that are basically my skin color in a bottle, okay? My top, top, top nude lipstick is gonna be Colored Rain Suede, okay? It's what I have on now. It is literally, as you can tell, it is my my skin so it it took me a while to get when it whenever I first got into makeup nude I'm thinking nude 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 would be my skin color right so why are all these pinky colors considered nude da, da, da. 
this is my skin in a bottle okay as you can see that's what i have on now it is literally my skin in a bottle love colored rain i own most of their colors which is sad but i love them they're probably my favorite um liquid lipstick brand and it's black owned too so support and yeah so suede um colored rain what i have on now my favorite 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 nude okay and then okay so last but not least OCC Lip Tar in Penny Something. My label rubbed off. This is their old packaging, so I have no idea what this is called. I want to say it's Penny Something. This is it right here. I don't know if I showed y'all Colored Rain Suede. This is Colored Rain Suede. But this is um, OCC um, Penny, Penny Something, guys. Um, it is literally the same as Suede on me. My lips my not my lips but my skin color in a lipstick form liquid lipstick form and um, if you have any familiarity with OCC they are um, long wearing lip sticks lip liquid lips but not in the sense of how liquid lips are now so OCC was around a long way before all of this liquid lipstick craze um, so it's a liquid lipstick, but not in this matte, matte, I'm going to suck your lips dry <laughs> type formula. So yeah, so, oh, I hope I can find it. If I find the, the true name, I will um, put it in the description box, all right? So yeah, guys, those are going to be my top one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten with an honorable mention <laughs> because it's too expensive. 10 with an honorable mention lipsticks nude lipsticks okay do not be afraid to find your perfect nude nude lipsticks are probably tops in my book just because you can pair them with any color eye of course today i came with a very um dramatic eye because i wanted to try that oh what's that color that black that's in the sephora palette that i swatched um the black with the glitter and it literally the glitter is still in it so praise but um you can pair nude lipsticks with anything you can go if you're going super heavy on the eye like i am today put a nude lip and it just ties everything together and lets your eyes shine if you're going really easy on on the eyes and really just want to have a chill laid back everything kind of muted look throw on a nude lip get you a nude lip these are my favorites if you think that any of these can work for you try them out okay what are your favorite nude lips put them in the comments or whatever to everyone that has subscribed to me since i've been back thank you um welcome to the channel i don't think i say my name enough my name is ashley so welcome 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 hope you enjoy my ogs y'all already know we we converse a lot so y'all already know thank you for sticking with me and thank you for continuing to watch me and if you just by chance found this video like comment and subscribe i upload pretty often nowadays hopefully that'll last but yeah guys <laughs> hope you enjoyed my top 10 nude lips and i will talk to you all later bye